Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Uh, the last video I shared with you, I was making some rosettes during my lunch hour and um, a lot of you commented on once, you know, they look nice and what have you and then once I add some embellishments or fix them up so they're not so uneven, they'll look really good and I said, you know what, I'm gonna take tonight and I'm gonna stay down in my craft room and I'm gonna make them look amazing. And I think I did it. Um, it's not, you know, very often that I do stuff like this, but now, let me tell you, I'm, I'm loving it. Absolutely loving it. So I was watching a video this morning and it's uh, Tamika with uh, Scrap the World and she was making um, the flowers out of vellum. And I said, you know what, I have that stuff. I have some vellum. So I went and I created this one. I'm not really liking the outside being so much bigger than the rest. I could have probably just done with a little cluster in the center. Um, but I had my punch or my framelits. And uh, this is the one here, my Sizzix one here. And it's just got the bunch of flowers and everything. And so I used that. And I only use the flower ones. Um, uh, you could do the leaves, but I chose not to use those. And then I just put a flat back pearl there on, on the middle and I hot glued them together. And I went, oh, okay, okay, that looks pretty cool. And I went, all right, well, let's do something with my rosettes. Hmm, see what I can come up with. So with one of them, I took the pink one and I created another one and I put the vellum flower on top and I die cut a little small butterfly with another halfback pearl. I thought, okay, now I get seen more you layer. You don't worry about what the, the rosette really looks like on the, the center. Now, okay, now it's all coming together. So that was that one. And then I started getting a little bit more creative. This is outside my norm, so um, it's not quite circular as I like, but that's okay. You know, you got to start somewhere. So I was making little clusters um, the other day here in my craft room. These little um, hole punch and the scallop and uh, just a bunch of circles and scallops. And then I did um, the little banner leggy things here. And I put them together and I said, Okay, I created some of that stuff just to have some layers of embellishments in that. So then I went, okay, added a little butterfly to it, more of my halfback pearls. And then I added this word lovely, which came from uh, this Pink Roses Prima, uh, Amelia Rose. And I can't find any of this stuff here. So I had to buy it on Amazon. I got it for a pretty good price, I think. Um, and then I went on to scrapbook, uh, scrapbooking.com or something, and I bought a whole bunch of different, um, different pieces. Not quite the chipboard. I think it's just the uh, ephemera. So, because I don't have any of that stuff, but I'm really liking these chipboard stickers and that. I wish we could get more of this stuff here, but unfortunately in Canada or even on the East Coast, I don't see much of this stuff. So then I just kept going, and then I created that one. Now these are all from the, the rosettes are all from the car when I was making them the other day. And again, I just had that little cluster that I already created, and I just um, put the uh, butterfly on top with my uh, dimensional tape so that it's just stuck out a little bit. Not quite as far as I want it to, st to stick out, but still turned out turned out pretty cute. And then I just went simple and just put uh, celebrate. Of course, I have backing on each of them. And so that one's just nice and simple. That one turned out pretty cute. Uh, then this one, I was just making little banners uh, to try and put them together to see if I could use them. And it actually turned out really cute on the little rosette. I did the butterfly and the halfback pearls and that on it. I think that's really super cute. I'm really liking this glitter and the pink and gold. I'm really into it lately, and normally my colors are black and white, but I'm really into the pink, the gold, and um, right now it's just the pink and the gold. I like the mint color with it as well, 
but just uh, I just it's really it's really pretty and then the last one that I made was this one here and I just used the um, get this from Walmart just the gold ribbon and I just put it around my finger a few times but I did it messy and then I have a little butterfly here that's dimensional and I made the word joy dimensional and again it's one of my clusters that I was making the other day and I put that string under it and it actually it's not too bad of a circle I need to fix over here a little bit maybe a little bit around but other than that I think they turned out super cute so from now on I will not be so down on myself thinking eh, they're not so good those rosettes well once you decorate them look how they come out I think they look absolutely amazing um, you know it went from from this to adding a piece on it you know you can add another piece who knew you guys have all uh, inspired me to create uh, such beauty and now I get to enjoy these 